Josh and Michelle here. And we are Adventures Ahead. Yeah. And today we got another Treat Treats box. box. We decided to give this one another go because we liked last the last one. Was one. Good. What and was the last one? Huh? What was the last one? The last one was Columbia. Columbia. Today we have It's a knife. <laughs> Helping us. Uh I don't like this knife. You this talked about, uh, this is your deer knife or something? Yeah, we skin deers with this. Ew. And not touching our treats. Just teasing. You didn't skin deers my, with No, that. my dad did. Don't cut yourself. I don't know what this box one is. From Asia, that was a clue. Oh, yep. But we don't know. We just got it today, so... Yep, we just got it today, so we thought we would unbox Hashtag it. Hashtag treat box. Hashtag treats whatevs. My nose is really itchy. Yeah. Oh! Is that Italy? This ain't Asia. That's Italy. No, that's Mexico. That's Mexico. Wait, I don't know what that is. We don't know where it is. We don't know where it is. What is that? We don't... I thought it was Italy. See... Oh, it's Mexico. But it said Asia. Wait, I'm getting Asia. I'm getting a card. That's not it. Where's our clue? It's right here, you son of my guns. Clue for next month. Next month treats come from a country located in Southeast Asia. <sighs> Treat box don't know. It's an island country that famous for its breathtaking beaches and temples. Well, I mean that is Mexico. That's not Asia. It's South America. Well, they don't even know nothing. Well, no. Is Whoa. Mexico, is Mexico in North America? Look at that, guys. Guys, we don't even know where Mexico <laughs> is. <laughs> it's in Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, read this. This month's treat comes to you from the amazing country of Mexico. Officially named Estados Unidos Mexicanos. Mexico is the third largest country in Latin America and the 14th largest country of the world. It's also home to 34 UNESCO World Heritage Site, one of which includes Cucalan Pyramid shown in front of the card. More than 13,000 years ago, Mayans and Aztecs built pyramids in Mexico. Unlike the Egyptians, ones were primarily meant for worship and other ceremonies. Most interestingly, these civilizations were the first to cultivate cacao, which paved the way for the worldwide distribution of chocolate. Cacao! Mexicans also love their herbs. Yeah, they do. And, <laughs> and this is materialized by the playful flavors in their food. In this month's box, you will find a selection of the most popular Mexican chocolate chips and other treats that represent some of what uh, Mexico has to offer. We hope you enjoy. We are we are fans of Mexico. Yeah, we love it. Yeah, we've been to Cozumel three times. Twice. Just oh, twice. Twice. We're planning on going again. In we've November. been to, yeah. We've been to Cozumel twice. 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 Puerto Maya once. I've been to Cancun once, and that was awesome. Here's their their, their recipe for the month is s chips and salsas. Is it oh. authentic salsa? salsa. So, explore Mexico is the other thing. And Mexican facts. Population. Read that, Michelle. Dang, okay, they put it small enough. 130 million, about. Language is Spanish. The landmass is 750,000 square miles. The capital is Mexico City. The climate is tropical. Uh... And that's all we really need to talk about. Okay, so the clue... For, oh, wait. We'll read the clue for next month after yeah, we're done. Yeah, and it's okay. probably not going to be right. <laughs> I so wonder the, if there's going to be spicy. So the first thing we got is a bag of oh. chips that's stuck what? in here. And they're Ruffles Queso Chips. And they're 150 calories. And these are like smushed up. Here, I'm going to read the thing card about it. So it's Ruffles Queso by Sabaritas. Trademark crispy chips covered in flavorful Mexican queso. Ooh. This is a treat that tourists definitely hoard when visiting. With its cheesy kick, we're sure to you we sure can't get enough of these. I got one for you. Oh. A small one. They taste like cheddar ruffles. 
with spicy or yeah, so. they're good. Mmm, they're freaking good. I don't think Michelle should eat the whole goddamn bag. You know what they say? You can't just have one. That's Jay's. That's who? Jay's potato. No chips. Lay's. We've had these before. I'm just grabbing something. We got. I want to do that last. No, do this All one. the chocolate ones are last. Okay, so read that one. Sabritas. I don't know how to say that. They're peanuts. They look Peanut spicy. Peanut sabritas. These ultra flavorful peanuts are Mexicans' favorite treats to munch while watching TV or playing board games. Taste a nut and you'll see what we do <laughs> not have to tell you why. That's a weird slogan. <laughs> Taste a nut? And we will not, what? <laughs> Have to tell you why. Interesting. They look sugary or salty. Oh, no. Ooh, those are spicy. Yep. Well, that's why I got caliente. A... Michelle, that's why they have a pepper on it. I know, but that has flames. it's spicier than I thought it would be. Yeah, those are good, though, but they're spicy. So now I think we should in integrate a chocolate. Okay. Sure. Carlos V by Nestle. Carlos V chocolate by Nestle. Named after Carlos V, the king of chocolates, has been a staple chocolate bar in Mexico since the 1970s. With its rich smell and unique powdery taste, you will not doubt why Mexicans think this is the number one chocolate. It's got a mustache on it. <laughs> hey, I must ask you a question. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> ah, there you go. You gonna eat the rest? No, I don't like chocolate that much. That's you. Mm. It's alright. That's really like a Hershey bar. But maybe not as good. It's a darker chocolate. Mm. I like it. It's pretty good though. <clears throat> We've had these before in a different box. These are... Thin and hot. But we'll try them again. Fuego. Tecas. Fuego. Fuego. The Tecas Fuego are hot chili pepper and lime flavored tortilla chips. Enjoyed by those who love it. extra spicy treats. Its product tagline is like fire walking with your tongue. Look how red these are. Oh my god. Don't touch your eyes. Hey, we'll be dead. We'll be dead. Oh my god. They're good though. Mistakes were made. Oh. They're like a really spicy. I don't know potato. how old this water is, but. Woo! I want another one. Michelle, we got other Those treats to good. taste. Everything in this box is like spicy. Not Here. the chocolate. Bululubu. Mmm. Those are good, though. Good flavor, but spicy. Yeah, they're good. Boo Boo Lu Boo uh, is a treat enjoyed by all ages in Mexico. <clears throat> Made up of chocolate covered marshmallow and strawberry smashed. jelly stacked together, you will be sure to asking for more. It's a little smashed. So take a bite and I'll take a bite. How big of a bite? Mmm. That's pretty good. Interesting. It's got marshmallow and jelly. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mmm. Mmm. And it's not... I'll take the last bite. Uh, this is a last bite? <laughs> this is a last yeah. bite. No. Man, I thought I wasn't hungry, but now I am somehow. <laughs> so... Is that it? That's our treat box. Oh, so man. let's What would you guys think about that one? That one actually was really good, too. I could have had a whole nother box from Mexico. So we're going to be getting this again. Because yeah. this is delivered. Okay, so our clue for next month is... Next bus treats will come to you from a country that has the oldest national anthem in the world. It is also almost flat as a pancake, and 30% of it is below sea level, making it the lowest country in Europe. Beer-loving tourists have this country on their Germany recognized as a national heritage site. What was the first clue? It's flat as a They're pancake. the reported as the second biggest coffee drinkers in the world. 
Ireland? Consuming an average of 3.2 cups of coffee a day. Finally, don't be surprised that the people from this country tower over you as they walk by. The people from this country were found to be the the tallest people in the world. Is that Holland? Because the tulips? Yeah, that's the Netherlands. I think it's Holland. Check out that. It's the Netherlands. So, yeah. Uh, beautiful card, again. Like, these are awesome. Yeah, these are cool. Like, we should hang those up on a wall or something. Yeah, we we got them still, right? All of them? Like yeah, yeah. Keep those. Okay. Um, so, yeah. So, what was, what your, was favorite your thing? My favorite thing in the box? Uh, oh, you can pick two. I'm going to say my favorite thing was the Blue Blue Lulu Boo. With the jelly and the chocolate and the marshmallow. I love that. That was good. What are you, Michelle? Oh, man. So hard to choose. Seriously. I really like those, actually. These? Yeah, I did. Michelle, these are yours. Tell me why. Uh, they were like a spicy Cheeto. Seriously, they were really good. Yeah, they were pretty hot. It's hot chili pepper and lime. And you could taste the lime. They are really good. So what was the worst thing in the box for you? The peanuts. Michelle's worst thing is the peanuts. I didn't like those. I thought those As, were good. I mean, they were fine, but... Worst thing in the box for me would have to be the chocolate. Oh, yeah. Just because I'm not a big chocolate guy. So, so yeah, there you go, guys. Um, so, yeah, hopefully you guys can try this treat box out. We've had one bad one and two good ones. The first one was bad. The last two treat have been box really good. made fun of us for it. They did? They said t- on Twitter. What would they say? Too much for you guys to handle. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to um, give this another try. Yeah. For sure. I guess it's past trying it after three. We're committed. Yep. And we got the island box hopefully coming in again. I don't know. I'm going to check on it. Maybe it was a one-time order. Huh. Okay, guys. Talk to you later. Bye-bye. Bye.